this. You wow. can't And it says my name right there. Hello and good morning. Welcome into a very special day. It's gotta be special. I've got a white shirt and no hat today, you guys. Today is Brexton's baptism day. It is such a big day for him. He is the ripe old age of eight, and when it's great to be eight in our church, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, kids have a chance to choose to be baptized, and Brexton has chosen to do so. We are so excited for him today. So we are getting kids bathed. We are getting into our nice church clothes. We've got the sounds of crew practicing his piano piece that he's gonna be playing today. More than anything, it's just going to be an incredible day for our Brexy. Crew is practicing his music this morning. He's got two pieces he's gonna play. One is I Love to See the Temple, and one is I Am a Child of God. So he's practicing those this morning so he can really nail it at the baptism. And then Brexton is gonna play a piece himself called When I Am Baptized. So he's gonna practice that this morning as well. Whoa! <laughs> and Brandon. Can we curl this? Yes, baby. Beautiful hair. Rexy Doodle practicing his piano piece over there. Are you guys feeling ready for today? Is everyone feel ready for what they got? Yeah. I noticed that Crew Doo seems like you're carrying a pretty heavy load today. Will you want to tell us everything that you're doing today? So I'm playing the first song and then song while he's getting changed into his white clothes and then another song and then also saying the closing prayer. Wow, so you could almost say this is the Crew Show. Ragai, what are you doing? Opening prayer. <laughs> Crushed it. Boom. So much. It's actually great. And then Brexton, are you doing anything today? Anything going on with you? I'm getting baptized. <laughs> yeah, Brexton's got a pretty big role today. And I will be performing the baptism. So Brexy and I will be doing that. Could we do? Doing a lot of piano work plus a prayer. Everybody's got a role. Everybody's got a part they're playing. Beautiful. Hazel Bingham, look at you with your green bow and green dress. What is your part today? What are you doing today? Um, I am leading the song. You're gonna lead the music? Yeah. Hazel, that's gonna be incredible. What is Maddie doing? So mom and Maddie are gonna be witnesses, so they stand on the edge and make sure I do everything right. Can't I want feel it. It's kind of like the story of my life. They stand right there on the edge, just looking over my shoulder, and making sure everything's done right. Seriously. <laughs> you wanna feel this? I wanna feel it. Ooh, so soft. Since this is Brexy's day, he has chosen literally everything, even the ties that we're wearing and mom's dress. He picked out my dress. And if you can tell, there is a theme going here. Got a blue suit, blue tie, blue tie, blue tie, mom, blue dress. Brexy Doodle, is that because of your beautiful blue eyes? <laughs> I think we are all ready. We just had a phone call with Mana and Papa Joe because they're not able to be here. We did a little prayer with him. I think it's time to head over to the church. It's kind of cool, you guys. It's literally just us. Maddie's meeting us over there. And then everyone else is participating via Zoom today. So we're going to yeah. bring a laptop, prop the laptop up. They can witness the program. Program, they can see the baptism. Yeah, we hope that the technology actually works and that people can watch it and be a part of it because we've got Jared and Britt traveling to Florida, Dan and Shell, Justin Lindsay, Sean's in Hawaii. People are kind of all over. My and parents are at home. And so now they can actually all be there and participate because of technology. As long as it works, as long as we can get that figured out and dialed in. We're gonna pack up all of our stuff. We've got change of clothes in there. Rex and I need to go get changed into our whitey whites and then get ready for this baptism, bro. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, and of course, we gotta take some pictures. We talked about the technology aspect of this. We're trying to invite people in via Zoom. We're here, but we can't get anybody else in the room, so we're trying to figure that out right now. Family's patiently waiting. They've clicked on the link, but it's not syncing up. We are new to the Zoom world here. Hello, Jared and Britt, Daniel and Michelle, Jody and Lynn, Sean, Ravelli. Thank you guys for being here. Okay, should we get started?
was holding it together and he was looking right at me the whole time and I was like, I just gotta get through this. <laughs> you did awesome. How well could you guys hear? You can hear good? You can hear perfect. Max, how does it feel, man? Good. Feels good? You're, you're the newest. No, big boy. There it is, that's a wrap. We Baptism 2020, we did it, guys. This is how it was witnessed and participated in. They learned that I am not good at technology. We are not great at it. It took us a minute, but once we got on there, crushed it. It was awesome. Leaving the church right now. It's official. Brexy Doodle, come here, buddy. Newest member of our church. The guy is officially baptized. Normally, so this is what we were talking about while we were in there. So family participated via Zoom. And a lot of the time with these things, it's a big family gathering. So there's a lot oh, of stress around getting the house ready, getting food ready, making sure you have all of the table settings in order. <laughs> there's so much that goes into it that it kind of takes away from the moment and I'm the experience. A less stress today. But because of the way that it's going down, because it was all done virtually, we're going to go out to eat right now as a family of reservations at a very fun restaurant called La Jolla Groves. It's kind of appropriate. It almost has like a reverent feel, a bit quieter setting. We thought that'd be the best place to go and celebrate our Brexy. But there's no stress, no fuss, just getting to enjoy the moment with our Brexy doodle. It's gonna be awesome. Man of the hour right here, Brexy doodle everybody. And it has this many forks, Butter knives, knife. mini plates. Where do we begin, right? Guy, walk me through it. Butter knife. Okay. Has a nice two degree curve. Okay. okay. This right. is your appetizer right. fork. Okay. Nice and small. Okay, okay. This is your main course fork. Okay, it's thank nice you. Nice and big. Okay. I don't actually know this, just go on with that. <laughs> this is your main course fork because it's bigger than this the knife, uh, but yeah. appetizer. Knife. Nice. And this is for holding. Okay. And then just go with this. And then what about for dessert? This is your dessert hand right here. Yes, dessert hand. <laughs> Definitely don't think we've ever had a family dinner where they bring you palate cleansers to start. <laughs> These are palate cleansers, the sorbets, I don't know what. It's like a little cream puff cut in half, but I came here a couple of weeks ago with Stephanie and we were like, palate cleanser? Yeah. What? That's why I knew this place was fancy enough to come. They don't special have people. those at McDonald's or chuck o For us, it's- We're in your brand at Maverick. We are getting the exact vibe we hope for today, guys, with an entirely empty restaurant, just our family, just focused on our Brexy. Very, very cool. Pretty special. Whoa, guys, check this out. Starting off with a gigantic pretzel to split with everybody and a really cheese good. fondue sauce. Wow, that's gonna be incredible. <laughs> The pretzel, <laughs> and we all get to share it. <laughs> Entree's coming out. Rexy did it with some pasta and Alfredo sauce, white sauce, is that right, with Parmesan? Okay, Delicious. Mom got some filet medallions with, it looks like broccoli on top. Broccolini. Broccolini. Got a grilled cheese here, another pasta dish there. Maddie went with the filet medallions as well. And then we have, I think, two more things coming. Gosh, that is Ruben. Yeah. Holy cow. Parmesan fries and a massive Reuben. Guys, we have been beyond wowed by the food here. I don't know why we don't come here more often. It's Salad was amazing. One. Like the ambiance, the lemon trees inside. Yes, everything has been so good. These Parmesan fries are unbelievable. Crispy all the way through. Rexy, how's the pasta, buddy? Good. Good, <laughs> love it. It's good you for like everything. Just so few words. You're good. <laughs> Finished up our meal at the La Jolla Grove. How was dinner, you guys? It what was did you think? so good. Well, I guess so it's lunch, good. but it felt like a dinner. dinner. Sorry, dinner. Dinner. Actually, how was your meal? Did you enjoy it? Yeah. I think it was the perfect place to go and celebrate. It was very chill, very calm. Also, delicious food. Nice, fun. A little bit fancier setting since we are dressed up for the first time in a very long time. But you guys, as we come out here, mom's doing a little bath and body work shopping, and we're checking out the Santa Village here. I don't know if you guys have seen the way they're doing Santas in different places. I went to the mall the other night with mom, and Santa stood behind plexiglass. Then you would line up in front of him, and then he would like come up and stand up against the glass like this and take a picture with you, which was super weird. This one, he sits back in a chair, it's fenced off, and you take a picture standing out here, he's back there. You go, you stand right there, Santa's back up in there, and then he sends you a little parting gift along a conveyor belt. Guys, people are having to get very creative with the way they do Santa this year. You guys leave anything in there for anybody else? I think it's here. What should we do next? Yeah, what, what do you guys want to do next?
Back home from the restaurant now from our delicious dinner and we've got some stuff out here on the island You might have seen this this morning. It had that birthday vibe that birthday feel and the islands all decorated nicely And I was kind of joking but kind of serious It is kind of like a rebirth day So it is like a birthday but a little bit different the gifts Maybe not as exciting for the kids but Brexit doodle has been wanting to see what's inside these boxes these bags these goodie sacks So Brexit doodle which one do you want to start with we got three here? I think but this one we're gonna wait until we can face time on and pop on yeah, maybe do this one first Oh, it's big. Dude, Maxi, look at that. Scriptures. Look at that, my main <laughs> man. That is a big dog. That's got everything in it. Pretty cool, huh? You can mark all your favorite ones. Pretty big, nice set. Brexton, Brandon, Bingham. Is that what the ones you wanted in cursive and in gold? Is that everything that you wanted? Oh my gosh. And um, then to go with it, scripture some scripture markers. markers. Is that the one you wanted? I could not remember. We couldn't remember. Is that it? Is it the mini backpack, right? So it can be a backpack or like a handheld thing? Like a side. Go and try it out and see if it fits. Braxton is on a FaceTime call with Mana and Papa right now. They are serving a mission at the Nauvoo Historic Sites. So they weren't able to be here, but they could join via Zoom, but they got him a very special gift. They get something for each of the grandkids whenever they're baptized. He's about to open that now. They just wanted to be on the phone with him over FaceTime when he opened it. Oh, wait, wait. Ta -da. Oh my gosh, dude, that is spectacular. That is so cool. Love you, little buddy. So this is the plaque that Mana and Papa did for Brexy Doodle. It's got his name, the day that he was baptized and confirmed, and this is I'm trying to be like Jesus. And then it has a bunch of traits that they said they see in Brexy Doodle that were also traits of the Savior, and so that's pretty cool. They see those in him. This will go in his room. Kruby's got his, Rag Guy's got his, all up on their dresser, so we're gonna go hang that up for Brexy Doodle now, but very thoughtful thing for them to do across the country there in Nauvoo. Brexy Doodle now has his plaque, opened up all of his gifts, he's been baptized. I think that's as much fancy reverence as we can possibly handle on a Saturday in this house. So let's get out of the these nice dress clothes. Let's get into some comfies and let's party, baby. Yeah. Whee! taking it slow this afternoon we have decided to change into jammies and relax and it's been an amazing afternoon I think sometimes when things aren't as busy like you're not like running around doing stuff setting up for a big party I mean that's obviously exhausting but I also think sometimes we can get like emotionally exhausted it was a big morning for our emotions I don't know it was so wonderful but I think we got a little tuckered out from it so we've come home and we have all kind of relaxed this afternoon and it's been really awesome dinner time has rolled around we are just pulling out everything from the fridge pantry random stuff Brandon just ran to the grocery store to grab a few things for us to have Sunday dinner tomorrow night because Maddie's gonna come over for Sunday dinner. Neighbor dropped my cookies for Brexit. That was really awesome. I was training my friend on how to use her Instant Pot. So I have my Instant Pot. I am actually not using it today. I'm just, just a decoration more so for right now. Closing up this amazing Saturday was definitely one for the books. One from Remember for Sweet Brex. He's been such a sweetheart today. That boy just radiates love and has this pure little spirit that is so incredible. That sweet boy deserves to be celebrated. And today, I think he definitely felt loved and he felt celebrated. It's been a really good day.
we are getting ourselves ready and into bed. Just finished watching a fun Christmas show. And Brexy Doodle, we had to have you here, buddy. Today has been a very special day for you. <laughs> yeah, I love you. Brexy Doodle had a very awesome day today. We were very grateful that you guys could be a part of it. Very special day. We're gonna get all of these guys into bed, even though it's been a pretty chill day. It's still been kind of like emotionally exhausting. Make sure you guys come back tomorrow. There's always something fun, especially this month of December. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. We love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye. Bye. You guys, I just realized that whole time I talked to you earlier, I have a zit patch on. It's just like your Probably skin. some of you noticed. At least you all know that they work.